If you're a person that's even somewhat interested in the paranormal, one instance of activity you might have heard about at some point is shadow people. A shadow person is usually described as a mostly dark entity that appears to be in the shape of a person made up of a swirly, smoke-like darkness, usually seen in the corner of a person's vision. Many cases of alleged hauntings have had their fair share of shadow people sightings. Heck, out of the probably 70 or so investigations I've been on during my time as a paranormal investigator, about half of them have had supposed sightings like these. So, today I would like to take a look at five times evidence of a supposed shadow person or something similar has been recorded on tape, and give my opinion on them. These are five shadow people caught on camera. Number five, Cemetery Shadow. I recently covered a clip of a video from the YouTuber Franco TV in one of my recent videos, where he gets locked in a cemetery and catches something odd with his camera. In his video, A Night to Remember, he is exploring yet another cemetery around 2 in the morning in hopes to get some paranormal activity on camera. About 19 minutes into the video, Frank seems to see something down by a door he claims to be a shadow. Now, it's hard to see, so he decides to get closer, and if you watch closely, as he approaches, you can make out what appears to be a shadow move from right to left. Doesn't that look like a shadow? Look at the door. That literally looks like a shadow. That's like the reflection of the other side of this wall. After it's seen moving, he quickly runs to look around the side of the building to see if anyone was there, thinking that it could have been a reflection of someone else in the graveyard. God. I'm sorry, I have to stop saying that. But holy crap. I saw a shadow. I think I saw a shadow. Now, I'm not entirely sure what I think of this one. While it does look pretty legit, I do also have to say that someone could potentially be around the corner in dark clothing that quickly moves away and around the other corner of the building. Though I would love to hear your guys' thoughts on whether it's real or how it could be faked, so make sure to put your theories down in the comments. Number 4. Shadow Under the Bridge Back in February of 2018, the YouTube channel Ryan Coolvitz posted a video of him and his friend going out to a supposedly haunted bridge in Michigan known simply as Ghost Trussell in order to try out a ghost hunting app on their phone, but that's not why I'm covering this video. Now real quick, there are a lot of apps out there like this one and I personally don't think they have any validity in what they claim to do. A standard smartphone doesn't have the components to detect EMF or even do heat vision, even though you will find plenty of apps that claim to do just that. In my opinion, the only type of app you can get on your phone that can be used to investigate would be an audio recording app, but I digress. After giving themselves some scares with the app, something weird does happen. As they were leaving the bridge, they turn the camera back to it as a truck passes under it. As it does so, a shadowy figure can be seen standing under the bridge where the pair were just investigating. At first sight, you might think it could just be a sign along the road appearing to be under the bridge due to how dark it is, but upon looking at the footage of the bridge taken during the pair's first approach, there is no such sign or anything else for that matter that can be seen. I think this one is pretty compelling due to that fact. Sure, you could say that they had someone stand under the bridge in order to get this effect, but that would mean that they had to know that another vehicle would be passing under the bridge as they were leaving. Also, the figure really doesn't have any defining features, even as the headlights of the truck light it up. Now, like with anything, I would love to hear what you think about this clip. Do you think that Ryan and his buddy caught a shadow person on film that night, or do you think they faked the whole thing? Number 3. Subway Shadow This next clip appears to be from a surveillance system in what I believe to be a subway restaurant. 
The quality isn't the greatest, as it only appears to be filming at around 10 frames per second, as well as being filmed from a monitor. A shadowy blob, for lack of a better term, appears from the bottom of the screen and slowly moves up and to the left until the video ends. At one point, you can see a man look into the store before turning back around and leaving. Some have theorized that he could have possibly seen the shadow figure and decided not to get something to eat there that day. Now, I personally think that this is nothing more than a bug on the camera lens and the man looking into the store then leaving is just coincidental. I have seen a lot of videos like this one while searching the internet for paranormal videos and just wanted to give my take on this particular clip as I think it's the simplest explanation. Number 2. Shadow on the Stairs Our number 2 clip comes from the YouTube channel Jeff Young, where he chronicles the investigations of his team, Ghost Tech Paranormal. On episode 66, they are investigating a home in Halstead, England, where various paranormal activity has been reported, including sightings of a shadow person. At one point during their investigation, one of their cameras aimed towards the stairs of the home picks up something really odd. You're, you're happy or whether I'm you know, annoying you, which I, I don't want to do. Movement on the stairs. Okay. What appears to be a shadowy figure can be seen forming at the midsection of the staircase and remains for some time. During this, Jeff says he hears something coming from that direction and as he goes to investigate, the figure can be seen stepping backward before disappearing. What makes this really cool is that you can clearly see the shape of a person's leg and foot as it steps backwards. Now, I find this clip very compelling, just for the simple fact that you can literally see the figure form from out of thin air as the activity begins. Though, as always, I would love to hear what you guys think, especially on this one. Before we get to number one, I'd just like to take a moment and ask, if you're enjoying the video, that you please give it a like. And if you would like to see more videos like this in the future, subscribe and click the bell icon to be notified the next time I upload. You can also follow me on Twitter at 2 spooky for you 5 Also, if you would like to support the channel directly, consider donating to us on Patreon at 2 spooky for you yt All donations go to helping the channel grow and get better, and there are some stretch goals that, if reached, will help fund a documentary on a local legend known as Raymar's Hollow. Thank you for your support. Number 1. Stadium Ghost Back in May of 2018, a security guard was making his rounds in the Thomas Adolfo Duco Stadium in Buenos Aires, Argentina, when he heard a repeated slamming coming from one of the dressing rooms. Yes. No sé qué está pasando, pero lo quiero grabar ahora para que después me crea la gente, porque esto nunca me pasó y, y nada, lo quería grabar. He begins to film with his phone in hopes to catch the culprit from camera, though he doesn't find what he's expecting. Dios. He comes to find the door to the dressing room, slamming on its own. Obviously freaked out, he grabs a broom to defend himself with, and makes his way into the room. Looking all around the room, he finds nothing that could have caused the door to act like it did, or so he thought. Upon looking back over the video, he notices a shadow figure move from left to right before disappearing into a wall as he passes over a bench. Some would say that this could just be his own shadow, but I don't think that's the case. At an earlier point in the video, he goes by the same location but no shadow can be seen. This mixed with the door slamming, and the guard obviously being freaked out, tell me that this clip is of a legit shadow person. And there you have it. Five supposed shadow people called on tape. 
Have you ever seen a shadow person? If so, I'd love to hear your personal stories in the comments section. And if you have any videos you would like to see me cover in future episodes. Until then, remember to stay spooky. I will catch you all later. Locals think that this could be an apparition of a man that was struck down by a train years prior when he decided to take a shortcut across the tracks on his way home. Appears to be a Bigfoot or Sasquatch can be seen standing in the tree line, seemingly observing the couple. They drive a little bit past it, and when they back up, 